Come let us adore him, Christ our Lord and our Savior. Well, today my message will be entitled, Do You See What I See? Do you see what I see? And lo, the angel of the Lord came upon them, and the glory of the Lord shone around about them, and they were so afraid, according to Luke 2 and 9. And so they were out in the field, the shepherds, keeping watch over their flock by the night. When something happened, the angel of the Lord came upon them, and the glory of the Lord shone about them, and they were so afraid. The shepherds could not believe what they were seeing before them. Do you see what I see? Well, the word see is defined as to perceive or detect as if by sight, to be aware of, to recognize. The shepherds was in total surprise to see what actually was happening before them. And the angel said unto them, the angel of the Lord began to speak to the shepherds in the field. Fear not, for behold, I bring you good tithing of great joy, which shall be to all people according to Luke 10. Do you see what I see? Good tidings, great joy to all people. And the angels went on to say, for unto you is born this day in the city of David, a Savior, the Messiah, the Lord. And this shall be a sign unto you. It was The angel was telling the shepherds, I'm going to give you a sign to know when you discover the Lord of Lords and the King of Kings. The angel said, you will find the babe wrapped in swanny clothing, lying in a manger. Oh, what news. Everybody ought to know that the Messiah was being born. Do you see what I see? I see the, the angels giving the shepherds instructions of what was actually taking place. No doubt the shepherds was, was confounded and surprised and then the Bible say afraid for what the angels was appear before them and, and what the angels was telling them about the Messiah coming. Do you see? And suddenly there was with the angel a mother too of heavenly hosts praising God and saying glory to God in the highest. Glory to God in the highest and on earth peace could we towards men. Because of whom God is, we shall always give God praise and glory for all the things that God has given us and all the things that God is doing for us, us and all the ways that the Heavenly Father is doing in our lives. We shall always give Jesus Christ and the Father praise and glory. Do you see what I see? Do you see what I see? I know, and so it came to pass, that the angels was gone away from them into the heavens. The shepherds said one to another, no mountain doubt. Did you see that? Did you hear that? The shepherds said one to another, let's go now even to Bethlehem and see this thing which has come to pass, which the Lord has made known unto us according to Luke 2, 11 through 15. And then, of course, there was other angels that suddenly appeared once again, as I said, and they was praising God, saying glory to God in the highest and on earth 
And now the possibility of peace and goodwill towards men. This was an exciting scene. This was something exciting to see. This was something amazing. And it says the shepherds departed. And so they came with haste. In other words, they was rushing to see what the angel had talked about. And they found Mary and Joseph and the babe, the Messiah. And when they had seen it, when they had seen it for their self, it was confirmation for what the angel had told them. And they made known, in other words, they spread the news. They made known abroad the saying which was told to them concerning the child. Telling the people what they saw it, and then began to tell them how they felt and but telling them what happened in the field. And all that heard it, everyone that heard it, wonder at those things which was told to them. Luke 2, 19, but Mary kept all these things and pondered them in her heart what the angel had told her. And Luke 2 and 20. And the shepherds returned glorifying and praising God for all the things that they had heard. And all the things that they have seen. Do you see what I see? And as it was, and all they that heard it wonder at those things which was told to them by the shepherd. Well, I give you a personal invitation today to see what I see and feel what I feel. That is truly good news. Then it was good news back then. And it's good news now. Jesus lives. And he has the opportunity to live inside of you if you just open up and let him in. Do you see what I see? Let us pray. Eternal Heavenly Father, God, we thank you. We thank you for the revelation. God, we thank you for being born, not just born physically, but Lord, being born spiritually in our lives. God, we thank you for your many blessings. We thank you for the doors open. We thank you for the ways that you have already made. And God, we give you honor. And God, we give you praise. Do you see? what I see.